You're watching Channel 4, the local station, live with Tom Wills, Mary Bear, the Weather Authority forecast with Chief Meteorologist John Gaughan, Sports Analysis with Mark Brunel, and Breaking News with Sky 4. News 4 Chats continues. You know, when so many people right now are struggling without a paycheck, a pay raise sounds like a fantasy. Unless you're a member of the Jacksonville City Council and you got an automatic $2,300 raise this past summer. Now, two councilmen tell News 4 Jacks reporter Jim Piggott they want to keep that from happening ever again. Jacksonville's 19 city council members are considered part-time, and with raises from last year, most make $52,276. The council president makes a bit more. All but two of the members accepted the raises. One of them is Councilman Al Ferraro. He told me he's never taken a raise since being elected. Councilman Roy Diamond, though, donated his raise to a charity. To give yourself an automatic pay raise while the rest of Jacksonville is in crisis is absolutely irresponsible and smacks of arrogance. Both Diamond and Ferraro, along with several other council members, are introducing legislation making council pay raises a bit more difficult to receive. Councilman Diamond is calling the legislation NOPE, no obligatory pay enlargement. I just say no to all uh, pay raises for politicians. So I came downtown today and there's lots of hardworking people here in Jacksonville taking their lunch break. And it was here where I was able to ask them, well, when was the last time you got a raise? Probably five years. What do you think of the fact that city council is, gets raises automatically? I think it should be based on the same president that we get raises on. I mean, it shouldn't be an automatic raise. Others question why raises for council would be automatic. I feel like for city council members, maybe there should be a different method only because sometimes at the end of it all, they're at the end of the year, sometimes they don't do the job or the things that the people ask for. And that's why Councilman Ferraro says this legislation is important. I just don't feel like being an elected official, you can give yourself a raise. And that's what this is about. And it also gives people the opportunity to come down and voice their opinion, whether somebody's doing a good job or whether they're not. Ferraro adds that if you're going to ask for a raise, you've got to be able to take criticism about your work from your boss, which in the council's case is you. Jim Pickett, Channel 4, The Local Station. This legislation will be introduced to the full council in two weeks.